Now, numerous firefighters battled a fire and the cold at the Crivets Lumber and Rental in Marinette County. Our Emily Byer joins us live in studio with the very latest details. Good morning, Emily. Good morning, Brooke. According to the company, this is a family-owned five-generation business founded in 1920, and unfortunately, the main building is a complete loss. At least 50 firefighters battled that blaze from almost a dozen fire departments. Obviously, the incredible concern being the extreme cold we're dealing with. When fire crews arrived on scene, heavy smoke and flames were visible. The Village of Crivets fire chief telling us they struggled with water lines freezing, staying warm, and keeping that water flowing. The below zero, our, our lines are freezing up. We had one truck that took long enough to get here and we, we had to fight the, the freezing truck on that and get that one thawed out. Um, the, the building itself being, being a lumber company with lots of chemical paint and heavy fire load around it was our biggest concern to try and contain it into the one main building. No injuries have been reported. Due to the fire, about 90 people lost power. Power has since been restored. The American Red Cross is on scene assisting those impacted. An emergency warming shelter has opened up for anyone needing shelter, and firefighters are using it to help rotate through crews to keep warm. The fire chief telling us they'll continue to shift through crews and rely on neighboring fire departments to continue to put out hot spots. They say they expect to be on scene for much of the morning. Reporting live in studio, Emily Byer, NBC 26.